Ladies and gentlemen, please rise and remove your caps for the singing of the national anthem by Maddie Stew. sign or not. If you bring a snake, you get a free ticket next week. Yeah, we keep bringing more people in and then only the same people that kept showing up keep showing up. So I guess it's an acquired taste. I don't... That's a one-to-one. -one. 
That is what it was. We're like oysters. I don't know if that makes sense or not. Oh, all right, guys. Dude, it's Tuesday night at 10.40 p.m. <laughs> same time every week. Same time every goddamn week, everybody. Same time, same specials. Yeah, <laughs> yeah get, get drunk if you're not already while you waited. <laughs> What's, do, do we have a... Haley, do we have a drink deal? Five fucking dollar Lone Stars. And they're not the tall boys. Don't ask. <laughs> I think there's a bar next door. <laughs> if you're sneaky or really cool, you can bring yeah. them in. This is the only show that's BYOB at this club. I make that clear. Yeah, and that's not... You, I mean, do that at your own risk. We don't... <laughs> We don't have a problem with it. Uh, guys, we got some fucking sick-ass news. I think. Well, I guess we'll find out. I'm not really sure yet. I haven't seen the show. There's been a lot going on. I yeah. Mean, you know, knows? that. <laughs> that shit. This is everything that's happened this week. It's everything. It's on one page. Yeah. And, and uh, yeah. We're here to bring it to you. Yeah. With the help of uh, the smartest people we know. Yeah. I, well, one or two of them, for sure, definitely. But, you know, guys, we start every good evening news with the headlines. Who's, who's excited for the headlines? <laughs> it's crazy. Wow, I got really excited. <laughs> All right. Do you want to... Yeah, I'll go. I'll go. I'll go. All right, you go. Uh, this week, the Supreme Court is hearing oral arguments to decide whether to restrict access to abortion pills... Which is ironic, because if people had used oral methods in the first place, we wouldn't be doing all this. <laughs> Guys. <laughs> all right, oh yeah. Guys, Dollar Tree has announced that they will be increasing the max price in their stores to $7 by the end of the year. Yeah, more like dollar, 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 dollar tree. <laughs> That fucking shit right there. Yes. I'm not sure if that was seven or not. <laughs> kind of lost track. Welcome to the dollar jungle, I guess. <laughs> so many dollars in here. Uh, after months of hiatus, news broke this week that Princess Kate Middleton has been diagnosed with cancer. But uh, it's not the worst way to go. She could have been diagnosed with a car explosion in a tunnel. <laughs> Like <laughs> uh, Jimmy Fallon has announced the return of his book club. Yeah, more like the big book club. That guy has a drinking problem. <laughs> the big book. You guys need to go to a meeting. He's uh, <laughs> going up against Oprah for the who gives a fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Trader Joe's has announced that they'll be raising the price of bananas for the first time in more than 20 years. In response to customer outrage, the company released the following statement. Hey guys, it's nothing personal. It's just monkey business. <laughs> you know what they say. Monkey doesn't grow on trees. It's bananas. Bananas grow on trees. Bananas grow on trees. <laughs> Oh, big news. Krispy Kreme Donuts is officially coming to McDonald's at the end of 2026, everybody. Yeah, they're also removing the mirrors in the restroom so you don't have to fucking look at yourself. <laughs> sadly, they're not sadly, they're not calling them McDonuts, but I McDonut give a shit. I'm calling them that. <laughs> fucking McDonuts. Make it work. <laughs> oh my God. Dairy cattle in Texas and Kansas have tested positive for bird flu. Uh, farmers in both states have decided to continue production with one farmer claiming, I don't care if there's birds in it, I'll stop drinking milk when pigs fly. <laughs> <laughs> yes, thank you, Kansas. <laughs> Uh, Olympic rock climbing gold medalist John J. Garnbrett, dumb name, uh, <laughs> took to social media to warn that climbing has a culture problem with eating disorders. 
the, the biggest one of them all, eating dicks. <laughs> more like, more like cock climbing, the fucking gay sport in the world. Yeah, eating disorder, eating that order, and then throwing them both up. <laughs> they like that one too, Nick. <laughs> wow, what a crowd. What a crowd. Was that all of them? That's the headlines. Dude. Nice. <laughs> we did it. We do. We can all go home now. I mean, I that, for the first time in history. <laughs> yeah, you guys good. like the headlines. Fuck yeah. Ugh. <laughs> oh. Well, uh, sorry if we're a little, a little tired. We were um, doing fucking cool shit all day, and uh, we were hanging out with the uh, advertising team. And uh, I mean, you've seen their commercials. They, yeah, they're, they're really, weird. really good. We're, we're trying to get boobs to sponsor the show. <laughs> 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 we just can't get big enough offer. Yeah. We've got butts. <laughs> We've got butts. Can't get boobs. Can't get boobs. <laughs> <laughs> boobs is a bigger grab than butts. <laughs> Friends on who you're asking. <laughs> Guys. I mean, hey, we gotta keep the lights off. <laughs> Guys, let's get this shit started. Can we get the... Did that one turn off during the thing, or is it not on at all? Yeah, it turned off. Can you turn it on? <laughs> Everybody close your eyes. <laughs> Everybody... I mean, it, it turned the spot back on. I mean, that, yeah, maybe keep that on. Yeah. Turn it. Can you get a brighter? Can you get a brighter? Not this spot. The the one that a little brighter. <laughs> just a tad bit. Yeah. Or a little bit less. Hold on, it doesn't hurt yet. Can, you get a little brighter? can we just get the fog back on? <laughs> can we just do something with the fog. Let's get this curtain up. All right, guys. We can't start this show just yet. We haven't. We haven't introduced our, our fucking best friend in the whole world. Yeah. An essential part of the show, and uh, yeah, and, and our weird ass cousin actually. A godless talent. Is what they've been calling him in the streets. A true scourge. A Satan's man. <laughs> guys, guys, it's Necromancer Nick, everybody. Get it up. Oh, you gotta stop doing that. Dude. You gotta stop doing that. Oh my god. Oh my god, Nick, how are you? Better than you, I bet. <laughs> what the fuck? No, in all reality, I'm, I'm not doing great. Oh. Uh, ever since uh, Pornhub was banned, I've been uh, carving er erotic figurines out of soap, and I am filthy. <laughs> I'm oh, just... I bet that stings, huh? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just... Well, Nick is our in-house music as well. And, uh, Never mention Nick, we get a tasty as lick for everybody. Make that thing talk for us one time. <laughs> Don't worry about it, I'll figure it out. <laughs> <laughs> about perfect. Is it connected to the lights? Is it? <laughs> Put your foot on it. <laughs> oh. Sick, there we are. Yeah. Alright, cool. Necromancer Nick. Oh. oh, we're actually gonna have a little bit of a family reunion, everybody. This uh this this first uh this first correspondent we have coming up, it's Grandpa Cecil, everybody. Give, give it up for Grandpa Cecil. Oh, it's Grandpa. Oh, Grandpa Cecil, how are you? Well, Jack, I'm doing pretty good. How about you? It's been a while. This is you never call, you never call. <laughs> Grandpa Cecil. Well, and who is this little Johnny? This is Mikey. Hey, oh, Grandpa Cecil. Oh, he looks just like your fun little Johnny. Big, big face. That's nice sweet. Small eyes. I... <laughs> <laughs> Nice to meet you, Mr. Cecil. Nice to meet it's you. It's actually Grandpa Cecil. Cecil. My bad. I always forget. <laughs> Me for once. <laughs> well, I'm sure you guys are wondering, what was Jackie like as a little boy? <laughs> well, I remember the day you were born. 
It was a good day. What day was that? <laughs> it was January 15th, 1993. God. <laughs> anyway, I... <laughs> I remember walking in that hospital room, and your mother, she was glowing, and she was crying. And I, I was gonna, and I, I gotta be honest, I couldn't keep my lunch down. Uh, one of the grossest babies I've ever seen. Uh, face like a, like a melted candle. And these huge fingers. But he grew up to be a swell boy. I'm so proud of you. I watched your comedy special, Raw. Um, <laughs> I love really good stuff. Um, and Jackie, Jackie boy. <laughs> Next grandpa says. <laughs> Remember that song I used to sing you as a baby? No, I don't. Maybe you could sing it right now. <laughs> I'll sing it. Maybe it'll come back to you. Maybe it'll put you right to sleep. <coughs> hush, hush, little Jackie. Don't say a word. Grandpa needs twenty-seven thousand dollars because he spent all of his money gambling on MLK Day. And if you don't give him money, he'll blow you all away. <laughs> He has a bomb strapped to his <laughs> No, 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 no. It has a dead man switch, so don't even try it. <laughs> What's it gonna be, Jackie? <laughs> <laughs> Just... Oh, I love the song. <laughs> I thought you might sing along. I used to sing it too. No, 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 I've forgotten the words somehow. <laughs> well, yeah, I need some money. Um, yeah, there's some people that are after me, so. Uh, well, we can sort something out after the show. I mean, you just, maybe. Could you at least pay for my flight? Yeah, yeah how much is that? $20,000. That's not. <laughs> Where are you flying? <laughs> I came from Russia. It's not. It's. It's fine. <laughs> did you? What did you say you were gambling on again? On. Yeah. Uh, slots. Oh. Okay. <laughs> when was it though? MLK Day. Oh, okay. Yeah, Atlantic City. Oh, they do a deal. It was the, <laughs> I mean, it's the spirit of the season. I <laughs> stayed at the Golden Nugget in Atlantic City. <laughs> And, um, yeah. <laughs> anyway, um, it was good to see you, Jackie boy. It was great I, to see you, girl. It's and so good to see you, little Johnny. Thank you. Thank you. Grandpa <laughs> <laughs> said so, everybody. Are we? Is it Scott? Scott, are you next? Yeah. Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> Just like I thought. <laughs> I'm pretty excited for this. Uh, I'm also excited segment, for this. I'm a Christian myself. I don't Same. know if anybody can relate to that. Yeah, where are my Christians at? Anybody? Oh, wow. <laughs> this really is a godless hellhole. <laughs> if you're a Christian, fall asleep for me. Good, good, good. good. Anyway, uh, <laughs> our next segment, it's a, uh, it's a new youth pastor. Okay? He's going to tell you why church is cool. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Church, is cool. Church is cool. New youth bachelor. What the fuck? Uh, tiny dance. Perfect. I do this. Yeah, no, I do a view. View then a slideshow. Slideshow. Hey, thanks for the great welcome, guys. <laughs> yeah. Appreciate you getting the room hyped up for me. Well, Very I, cool. I didn't see a name. I didn't Very cool better. of you. <laughs> hey, guys, let, let's let's give it up for God. Woo! On God. Woo. Come on, Texas, let's give it up for Christ. Yeah. Woo. That was an interesting one. 
I didn't say white Christ. You don't have to yee haw at him. <laughs> Look, gang, I've been a pastor for 30 years all around the southern states of this great fucking country. And I'm telling you what, pews are emptying out, all right? People don't love God like they used to. Say boo to that. Boo. That's right. That's right. So I got myself uh, uh, the youngest guy I know. Son. Uh, this is uh, this is my assistant youth pastor Ezekiel. Everybody. You can call me Izzy E. <laughs> <laughs> That's not the God-given no. name your mother gave you, Ezekiel. Okay. Yes, it was. So uh, he's been advising me on how to make church cool again. We're going to make some changes to uh, Christ Love Church Benny. over on Lamar. It's going to be great. So, uh, so let's let's take a look at what we've been we've been doing. Some renovations. First off, Ching. first off, the clicker don't work. Clicker's fucked up. What? I'm just going to scroll. We're going to scroll this one again. Why should you... Why should I go to church, gang? God's plan. You shouldn't ask. But we got some shit going on. We, we're vaping in church now. We're, we're blowing fat, cl fat clouds for Christ. On God. On God. For real. For real. On God, our Lord and Savior. Sick as hell. Uh, now, guys, you may have forgotten Christ is rad as fuck. <laughs> Christ, Bussin. Christ is, as the kids would say, a, a pretty chill dude. <laughs> pretty, uh, pretty fucking cool cat. That's our Lord, man. No I mean, cat. look at this. He's smoking a joint. He's, uh, he's got chest hair. He's wearing his own sick-ass cross. That's sick. Fuck, man. Christ is cool. Riz, can I get an amen? <laughs> amen. Hey, man. Look at this shit, dude. We got Jesus dunking on Satan. <laughs> Fucking basketball. For the demographics, I don't really appeal to. <laughs> Y'all are welcome. Just yeah. pay fucking tithing. Uh, we, got, we got skateboard Jesus. Fuck yeah. Kick flip for Christ, am I right? And then uh, we got Jesus helping this guy do heroin. <laughs> got a big old smile on his face because he don't judge. Christ doesn't judge you. It's pretty cool of him. Pretty cool for Christ. Heaven yeah, brother. That's a, that's a cool new saying yeah. I'm trying to get going. Heaven yeah? Heaven yeah. I, I like that. Yeah. You ain't going, but... <laughs> Mikey, you might have fun. I'll see you there. You want to skateboard with Christ in heaven? <laughs> I think I can make it happen. He'll teach you how to holly. It'll be sick as fuck, dude. We're going to empty out our baptismal font. <laughs> and uh, we're going to let we're gonna let the youths uh, use it for, like, a skate bowl. And uh, that's, that's pretty cool, right, young people? Yeah. yeah I like that. Yeah. Yeah. Who's going to do a kickflip for us right now? Go get a skateboard. Um, <laughs> we support Israel, no cap. <laughs> Moving on. <laughs> Wait, what was, what was up with that? Don't worry about it. Uh, what, what, what's up with that? What's going on with that last Don't time? worry about it. Also, oh, okay. you're all here. You all agree. It's fine. We're all on the same page. Anyways, Jesus was bisexual. Fact. Biblical scholars have uncovered new documents that prove no Jesus way. Christ went both ways, man. Pretty cool. Any bisexuals in here? Woo! All right. <laughs> you gotta see this guy sick as fuck, dude. Give it up for Easy E, everybody. Sup? What's up, fam? He's got a sick ass katana. God damn, I love you guys so much. Fucking ink on his arms. Mm -hmm. Christ, is, Christ in his heart. She. He's had me as a father figure for twenty years. People say, Pastor, why are you hanging out with that little boy so much? I say, mind your business. <laughs> God made us come together. May his came to come together. Uh, okay. Hey, hey, cooler. All right, together. Together. <laughs> we'll keep like it in professional. Come on, cool, cool. Happy cool. for you guys. All right, anyways, we're moving along. So Jesus is bisexual. That's cool. We're learning a lot about Christ. Think about it, though. Bisexual, lucky bastard. He's got... Six holes to use. That's fucking cool. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? What the fuck? Oh, wow. That's just the kind of fun time you can expect at Christ ah. Church. We're having a good time. We're goofing off. Getting, you know? into, getting into memes. We're, we're, just, we're, just, we're, just, we're just Josh and we have a good time. <laughs> Do I actually think Jesus uses the, the wounds in his hands that he, he, he saved us all with to, to use for men to sodomize it? No, I don't think that. But hey, we're having a good time. 
Oh, hey, uh, new rule at church, by the way. Masturbation's totally cool. Who's jerking off in here? Yes. Come on. It's actually sense. how I met Ezekiel. He wouldn't stop when he was younger. <laughs> Neither what? what? He could have used he could have used old old the uh, fucked hands of Christ over here. Jesus Christ. To show we're cool with the, with the gay community. We're doing drag queen brunch every Sunday for there the for the little ones. Bring your kids, leave them alone in a room with this man. And he's gonna yell sexual expletives at him. It'll be cool. Surf grass, surf cut. They're still gonna have food, right? Oh, there'll be food. Okay, cool. That's all. But it's saying. vegan. <laughs> I'm kidding. We're not gay. All right. Uh, this is a nice sound, right? Look, we're pretty fucking progressive over at Christchurch. Free abortions every Sunday service, no questions asked. And if you're worried about like, oh, what about the soul of the baby? We uh, squirt a little holy water up in the pussy before we... Jesus, we, that's perfect. Before we kill that little fucker. So, that's like, they have free pass to heaven. Pretty cool. Abortion hits different. Pretty and cool. Church. Figure it out, Republicans. I don't know what to fucking tell you. If you're so worried where there's a will, there's a way. All right, gang. Uh, also, there's a film crew poking around the church. Uh, just ignore those guys. <laughs> They're going to ask you questions. Don't worry about it. We're, uh, we're pretty excited. There's a documentary coming out on Netflix this fall. Gonna be pretty cool about the church. Don't talk to him. <laughs> Is he you got your back to the crowd? That's not really showmanship. That's not really. Oh, that's fucking cool. Yeah, Give it up for Zeke. Give it up for him. That is so sick. Now, now, Zeke, you got the communion right there, brother. Give me that. Give me that there. Their dish of communion. So, fellas, this is our latest implementation of the Sunday service. Communion crackers, wafers, bread, it's old hat, man. We know the youth like a little extra something. So we've uh, we've replaced officially communion wafers, wafers with these little Zen packs here. <laughs> oh, that's, that's Christ, awesome. Christ that's has perfect. died for your Zins. You know, you see that, you see that game name. Good job not so, carrying the lead. Yeah, so we're going to we gotta no, do it. No, do it. no. Body of Christ, hell yeah. Bless you, dude. Amen. Hell yeah is our amen. Oh yeah, hell yeah. Oh, they're milk flavored. <laughs> now give it a bit, it'll turn into wine, don't worry. All right, let's get this music going. Long haired son. Lovers of Christ, man. if you would like Holy Communion, get on up here and I will save your fucking soul. I am a sinner who is probably going to sin again. If anybody wants to find themselves, become a new person, oh. please come up to the front. All right, this is your opportunity. In an organized fashion. <laughs> it's an opportunity Body of Christ. to start over. Body right. of Christ. Hell yeah. Amen, sir. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. What the fuck? Hell yeah. It's a new life for you. Body of Christ. Hell yeah. You, you bisexual? I'm a bisexual in that room! Get on to your boyfriend. Body of Christ. Alright. This has like Waco vibes. <laughs> hey, that's my father. Keep his name out your mouth. Get on over here. Body of Christ. Body of Christ. Alright. We'll see you fucking Sunday, you dipshit losers! Give it up for the new youth pastor, everybody. Guys. Is he this? His sidekick. Is he we'll that out here for you? Oh, oh, thanks, guys. All right. Yeah, every time. <laughs> no, just just lean it up against him. <laughs> every fucking time. All right. These little lines a little longer there. We know religion is a little. Uh, what is? It? Well, no. Uh, not, I mean, that, maybe, but <laughs> that had a little something to it, but uh, deci d divisive. Oh, God, I'm so good with words. Uh, don't, don't do this. <laughs> I'm trying to move on. Religion's decisive. Anyways, guys, debate season's coming up. The election is right around the corner, and uh, we're going to have a debate here on the show. Are you guys excited to get a little prelim for this? <laughs> Everyone, make it loud right now for your first debater. It's Joe Biden, everybody. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Joe Biden. Joe. On your left. Baha. Hi. Wait. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Looks as 
sharp as that? Ah. <laughs> uh, my name, I'm Joe. <laughs> That's my name. And I'm here to address the South by Southwest crowd. No, no, Joe, that was... I'm here to address uh, the bombing on Gaza. <laughs> my name's Joe. <laughs> Oh. oh, not again. Oh, no. No. Oh, my God. Go away. <laughs> Daddy, get out of here. Hey, you want another mic? It's my birthday party. I don't need a mic, folks. Can't silence the truth. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, you use a mic down here. That's why I named my social media platform Truth Social, folks. Get out there and send some truths. Do you want a mic? <laughs> Why not? We'll go with that. While I'm doing that, Joe, you left your diapers in the oh. bedroom there. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Might want to go ahead and change. Thank you for bringing those out. Smelling a lot of bullshit out here, folks. I want some ice cream. <laughs> yeah. What the fuck? Maybe if you're lucky. I don't know if this is... <laughs> I hear they've got some great stuff stocked up for you there at the White House, Joe. Oh, Jesus. Can we get a handle around here, folks? Can somebody help the president? I'm the president. Vice President Joe Biden, everybody. Good, you're the president, Joe. Exactly. The worst, most failed president in all of American history. Amen. There you go. Be relatable, Joe. Talk about those balls outside of Target. <laughs> Talk about the hole in the pen cap, Joe. <laughs> Are we... Are we supposed to bring anybody else I'll up? tell you right now, this no, is what I'm we're going to do, birthday. folks. We're going to go ahead and have a real debate. We're going to make what? this debate great again. I We've got know. a great moderator, folks. Oh. I've known him a long time, a long time. First time I met him was at my very own casino, Trump Hotel and Casino, Las Vegas, Nevada. Great place. He's a bad man. You know him. He's the, the voice of the octagon, Mr. Bruce Buffer, everyone, let's go. Let's give it up for Mr. Bruce Buffer. Who's ready for the secondary? Jesus. Fucking Christ. <laughs> Joe, Donnie, thanks for having me. Mr. President, please. Well. Yeah, thank you for telling them that. <laughs> I'm the president, Joe. Keep telling yourself that, Joe. We all know you stole the last election. Round three's coming up here. Are you dinosaurs ready for this shit? We doing it? I can't stand in the shower. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, we got RFK. Oh, Jesus. Oh. Don't let this guy in here. Oh, my God. Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for RFK Jr., everybody. No. You can recognize me by my voice. I'm RFK Jr. <laughs> You look nothing I, like RFK. I'm running for president. Like, I'm a fucking Kennedy. Like, we all know, Barbie. We all know. My, my family. family. My family's corpses built this country. That's a. Uh, <laughs> what happened to this man? That's a pretty full head for a Kennedy. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Let's take him over to Dallas, folks. Maybe we can help him out with that. Who's ready for question one of the debate? Today's debate is brought to you by Sonic Happy Hour. You won't miss it today, but it'll be tomorrow at 12 p.m. Thank you, Sonic. Uh, oh. Sonic drive through Okay. Candidates, are we ready? I'm always ready. Always ready. So stay one. Joe, you're okay. awake. What time is it? <laughs> okay. It's time for the debate, Joe. Are you ready? I'm ready. All right. All right, okay. You good? I'm good. I'm good. Question number one. All candidates, if you could fight one of your opponents right now, who would you choose? Excuse me, excuse me. I'm going to go ahead and take this one, folks. I'll take it. Let me take this one, Joe. There's only one person on the stage that needs a good beatdown. That's RFK. We've already beat Joe once. I can't do it again. Not in a public place like this. I can't move my arms. Well, I... I have the vaccine, so I'm you know, okay. the strongest man here right now. It's a wonderful vaccine, folks. I did a tremendous <laughs> job. Lots of lives saved. More lives than we can even know. Ladies, they've been talking a lot. 
Question number two is brought to you by Shut Up You Hoes Up Front. <laughs> Question number two, what's your approach for solving the border crisis? Mm. Go ahead and take that uh, joke. Uh, right. We've been waiting a whole year. year. Uh, I think I've been solving it really nice. I, um... I put a, I put up some uh, I put up some fencing in my yard uh, for my dogs. They're, it's purple. But yeah, and I'm Joe. And we all know where the fence came from, folks. It's already been bought and paid for. It's gonna be a beautiful border fence. I partnered with the good people at Rubbermaid. Good to see you out here, section 119. Hmm. Known you a long time. We're just gonna press and seal that border. And after we do that, folks, we're gonna drill, baby, drill. We're gonna suck up all that black gold, folks, all that hey. tremendous oil, and we're gonna sell it right back to them, and we're gonna pay for that wall. You know, oh. yeah, that sounded pretty legit. I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be honest, that sounded pretty good. It's okay. Uh, I, I'm not worried about those aliens. I'm worried about those aliens. They're coming. We're gonna oh, God. wall in space, okay? I know that there's not a gravity, but we'll find a way. He, he thinks the Mexicans live in space. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Don't All right. Question number three is brought to you. If this hoe opens her fucking trap one more time, you will be removed from the show. No. <laughs> Question number three, folks. What's your plan to tackle inflation? Tremendous vaccine took care of it tremendously. But once we fix the deficit, inflation's gonna go down, folks. It's gonna be the greatest economy you've ever seen. So big, bigger than my cock, folks. I'm telling you, it's gonna be tremendous. Get, get the vaccine. Speaking as the person with the biggest cock here. Uh, Everything's getting bigger on inflation, cogs, assets. Everything's big now. Get used to it. That was good. Question number four is brought to you by Jack's Gaping Asshole. Question number four. It's really huge, folks. It's really huge. I've been inside. Many times. Question four. Candidates. What? Is Ukraine? Oh God! Uh, Ask his son. <laughs> That's right, folks. Ukraine. I'll tell you what it is. It's another failed mess from another failed president, folks. The worst president in United States history. And once I'm reelected for our third term. That's right, three, Joe. We all know what happened last time, because these good people are going to go ahead and walk their ballots in. No more bail-in ballots, folks. We're gonna get them all counted, and when they come back, and I'm re-elected, folks, the first thing I'm gonna do is get us out of that failure in Ukraine. Your eyes are white. Bare minerals. All right, question number five. <laughs> RFK subtitles are brought to you by question number five, folks. Who's ready for question number five? I'm ready. Candidates, what is your position on gay marriage, specifically Jack and Mikey? Well, I, you know, when I was a boy, I had a, I had a little fling, and I, and I don't, I don't blame them, you know? I know Jack's gay. One time he came over to my home, and he said, Joe, Joe, just, <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm not trying to cry. He said, Joe, put my penis in your mouth. And I said, I don't want to. I'm the president, goddamn. 
What a disgrace, folks. What a disgrace. I'll tell you right now. I'm so sorry. That's the Bidens, folks. One of the worst families ever. Unlike my own family. That answer was so long, I forgot the question. But whatever it is, we know he gave the wrong answer, folks. Well, this is all, this is all been pretty gay to begin with. Uh, <laughs> I don't care, just vote for me, please, somebody vote for me. I, I, I'm independent, nobody believes in me. Uh, it's a pretty solid argument, honestly. You got my vote, brother. I'm voting RK Jr., baby. Give it up for him. Come on. All right, folks, that's it. I'm not having another stolen election. Thanks, everybody. I gotta go somewhere. Put your hands up. This is a robbery. Take this, RFP. All right. Don't chase him too fast. Uh, ich bin ein b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b b just don't, don't vote. Just don't do it. They Go took my RFK. I mean, give it up for RFK, everybody. Yeah. I'm giving it to whoever gets me my fucking porn back. It, I, I know that that family ever got a chance. I know that dude's beating off. All right. Oh my god. Well, guys. <laughs> You guys know that bridge that collapsed yeah. from the cargo ship? Yeah. There's a bridge that collapsed from the cargo ship, if you didn't know. The Francis Scott Key Bridge actually collapsed, and we have some live updates right now from our friend uh, Joey. Are you going by your name? Yeah. Joey Smith, everybody. <laughs> Give it up for Joey Smith. That was a long one. Just got back from Baltimore. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's in Baltimore. Yeah. Be more. Be, be more. Be more. Be more. Be more of a stable bridge, man. <laughs> <laughs> that thing crumbled, dude. Oh, that was insane, dude. It looked like uh, Six Flags after Katrina. <laughs> just short metal, lines. Just metal hanging out of water, you know? <laughs> Saddest thing I've ever seen. Anyway, what we know, it was hit by a cargo ship. There it is, happening in the night. Six are assumed dead and two were rescued earlier today. The Coast Guard says finding survivors is unlikely. I, however, disagree. You're going to tell me that fine people of Baltimore haven't lived in their car for 48 hours? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. All right. What should we know? Who's behind this? I took this picture. <laughs> Who would do such a thing? I think I have an idea. <laughs> Such a fucking moron. <laughs> Of I, tell me why they wouldn't. <laughs> of course. <laughs> Those guys are big, dude. What the fuck? Yeah, terrorism's a big deal, Jack. <laughs> you know, I can't believe you made this on a fucking computer. <laughs> you remember when this is what the Joker looked like in New Orleans after Katrina? No! <laughs> no, I never remember that at all! Oh, damn, I should have put that in there too. Anyway, these guys did it, or this guy. One of the two. <laughs> one of the two. There's only one man who can solve this video. McNulty from The Wire. One of the best detectives to ever live. In, in Baltimore. <laughs> in Baltimore, yeah, it's based in Baltimore. There's a couple scenes with this bridge in it. It's quite sad. <laughs> you guys should really watch this show, The Wire, though. Seriously. 
It's a really good show. It's like Brooklyn Nine-Nine without all the dumbass punchlines, you know what I mean? <laughs> they got a hot gay captain, it's a whole thing. You guys should check it out, that's his partner, she's always got an attitude. <laughs> this is a bad guy in the mirror, it's kind of foreshadowing. <laughs> I think that's Idris Elba. He's on, it should have been Omar in there. You guys seen the show The Wire? Yeah. Anyway. Uh, <laughs> It's all a distraction, folks. They're trying to distract us from the reality of what's really going on. They are trying to take <laughs> down a legend! <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. Can't a man just take a fucking flight <laughs> without being assumed guilty? Isn't there some kind of law against cool... Grammy winning black guys doing shit they're not supposed to? <laughs> Isn't there some kind of special bill that we could pass? Like maybe it's not legal, but it's decriminalized. <laughs> We're gonna call it Proposition Kelly Diddy 69. Texas isn't having that shit. <laughs> California's cool with it which is kind of on them. <laughs> anyway, uh, free Diddy. Um, oh my fucking. <laughs> is that the end of it? Yep. <laughs> no peace, so we're equal. Joe Smith, everybody. <laughs> Making sense. Holy fuck. A very clear message. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> Oh, it's obvious what you gotta do next, guys. All right. You gotta get out there and vote. You gotta get out there and fucking vote. You gotta vote. <laughs> Where is this? My next correspondent, he's gonna... Ah, he's gonna talk a little bit about what we all... What we all know is true. It's a history of love by Dan Saldica, everybody. Dr. Dan Saldica. The history of love. It's spring, everybody. The season of love. Everybody knows that. Thank you. Thank you, Nick. Necromancer. It's my favorite love song. <laughs> What's that? It's me, Dan Saldica. Yes, PhD. I am the love doctor. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Uh, this is uh, my presentation. Yes, I am the same Dan Saldica that was featured on the Delilah's the Coffee Showcase. <laughs> <laughs> Front porch, they got great tricks. Uh, thank you. Uh, all right, when we talk about love, we gotta. We first have to get into it. Who invented love? We must ask ourselves, right? Mm. Newsflash. Newsflash. It's not who you think. Crazy. You have to ask yourself this question. Who invented the electric chair? <laughs> That's where the story of love starts. <laughs> I know I got you all excited, but it's actually not him either. Uh, that was, that's the guy that invented the electric chair, unfortunately. Uh, but, but that is where our journey starts, because who do you think of when you think of electricity, right? You think of, you think of Zeus. <laughs> And who did Zeus make with his blood and cum? Aphrodite. Uh, right? Makes sense? Uh, with all that being said, we all know who actually invented love was uh, Kim Jong-un. Uh, <laughs> Butterman himself. <laughs> Fucking Jesus. Well, what's all this have to do with love? Absolutely nothing. Uh, prostitution. <laughs> Mm. Now that's what I call real love. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Hell yeah. <laughs> Big smile on Nick Adventure, Nick. Bring it back. All right, now I'd like to go through the types of love uh, that we all can experience, right? Uh, random types of love. All right, first get into it. Uh, pet love. You know, uh, the, uh, <laughs> this is uh, things you'd have for your goldfish that's not in his bowl. 
sometimes. <laughs> your dog, your fucking the animal. <laughs> All right, uh, then we get into uh, another type of love. This is uh, sexual love. <laughs> Why are the same pictures still up there? Hand hand. Now listen, Jack. <laughs> I know that you noticed that all of the pictures are the same, <laughs> except for one. <laughs> and to that I say, uh, Jack, you have to open your mind. Uh, <laughs> Alright, uh, the next form of love. Parental love. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> Making the right call when you think your parent is in need of help. <laughs> Uh, and uh, lastly, I'd like to talk about platonic love. And that's, uh, <laughs> that's, that's, that's <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> making sure your coworkers feel safe at work. Feel, uh, you point them in the right direction. You know, if they're not doing something right, you go. Seriously. <laughs> Don't Seriously. fucking touch me, you motherfucker. <laughs> no, stop. And lastly, love for Iceland. Uh, <laughs> I don't really know what this is about. Yeah, there's some Iceland facts. You want any of those? Fuck it. No yeah. McDonald's. One of the first. Hey, shut the fuck up, you. <laughs> <laughs> shut the fuck up. Shut the. F this is my time. I'll fucking shoot you with this laser remote. You want that? The old dog. You can follow if you fuck. Go, oh, yeah. This, this, this show's about you now. You retard. All right, thank you. I can't get on as an old dog. I just said retard. Guys, he's a doctor. You, you guys, you can trust me. Give it up for Iceland. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, now I know what you guys are wondering. What do I love? Uh, I, what don't I love? Actually, <laughs> I don't want to get into that right now. I want to get into. Well, actually, no. I guess I have to get into it. I don't love two things. I don't. I don't love peanut butter jelly without the crust. And the aboriginals of Australia. No. <laughs> All right. <laughs> the crust turn. has all the flavor, and also it's not just your Australia. Why are you dressed like ghosts? You're just. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Oh my God! It's Cupid with a, a fucking pistol. <laughs> Select. As I just say. I think that might be it. What the fuck? Is that That's it? it? Oh, I, I just wanted to let you guys know what it is to love. And uh, if anyone has any shampoo, I could really use some. Not your dick, so I think everybody. <laughs> All righty. Oh, this next one is. Uh, I'm actually interested to see what this is. Um, guys, give it up for for real, for real. With uh, is Nick here? Hey, for real, for real. There you go. Don't you sent me a dude. All right. Hey guys. Now I will open this somehow. <laughs> you got it. I'll figure it out. How y'all doing? Good? Good. Interesting. <laughs> interesting. Very interesting. Okay. Alright. How you doing, right Mikey? <laughs> What's up, Nick? I'm just chilling, dude. Hanging out. And now we're doing this. Let's give it a uh, make some noise for Jack, everybody. <laughs> yeah. Make some noise for PowerPoint. Oh, yeah, how are you? I'm, I'm good. My girl tripping. So. Oh, okay. 
I'll be honest. I hate to hear that. I know. It's tough. She tripping, dude. I try to do so much. I don't know what to do. She's always tripping. And I'm trying to explain. I'm like, I know I'm not crazy, so I'm going to explain to you guys. You guys want to know why this bitch is tripping? Yeah. All right. Seriously, <laughs> this bitch tripping, all right? My girl tripping. All right, this is some shit that happens, all right? I'm hanging. I'm hanging with my boy Sisyphus. <laughs> Sisyphus the other day. Y'all know Sisyphus? I know y'all know Sisyphus. The trials of Sisyphus. And he's like, man, my mom's coming into town. Can you take up my trial for a day? And I'm like, you my boy, Sisyphus. I'll take up your trial for a day. Of course, Sisyphus, my boy. And this is Sisyphus. You know what I'm saying? That's my boy out there. And he's like, bro, I just need help this one day. And I'm like, you my boy. You, you know, me and him go way back. Like, way, way back. And so here's me. I'm doing my shit. It's fine. I'm strong as fuck. It's no big deal. I'm pushing this shit. Here comes my girl. Why are you, why are you even knowing me? <laughs> Bitch. <laughs> Bitch, if you don't let me push this boulder, heavy as fuck, you see this boulder is heavy as fuck. Bitching to me. Stank ass broad. Leave me alone. I'm pushing my rock. Fucking bitch gets on my nerves. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm mad, bitch. I hate that bitch. This bitch tripping! <laughs> she cool, though. Uh, <laughs> she cool, though. At the end of the day, I do love her, that bitch. And, you know, just shit like that keeps happening. I don't know what to do. You know, like the other day, she's like, oh, it's too hot. What am I supposed to do? It's too hot. I control the sun. Am I supposed to change how hot it is? What do you want me to do? Rip, rip the head off of the sun god Helios? <laughs> Ushering in an unprecedented age of darkness to the land? Is that what you want me to do? You fucking dumb broad? But I love her though, you know. So, so here I am, you know. So I go do it. I'm ripping his head off. That's Helios right there. That's me. Different haircut. It was a little bit ago. That's Helios. That's me. Ah, strong as fuck, right? Ah, look. Blah, his head comes off. Fucking bitch. Loser. Trying to square up with me. At a bus stop. Helio's trying to square up with me at the bus stop. Idiot. Rip his head off. Blow! Hold his head up like that. Get his ass. Idiot. Usher in. An age of darkness to the land. I knew this shit would happen. I told this bitch. He controls the sun. There's no crops. There's no crops. Now we're fucked. I do all this for this bitch. Yeah. This ungrateful bitch. Guess, you know, she has a nerve to say to me. Ooh, I'm cold. <laughs> Ooh, it's too cold now. Bitch, I told you about the unprecedented age of darkness. That's a million winters. I told this bitch. <laughs> Fucking dumb broad, dude. This bitch tripping, dog. She cool, though. <laughs> she cool, though, at the end of the day. What are you gonna do, you know? Fucking bitch. Always something, dude. Some of y'all can relate, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> Always up to some shit. The other day, she go, look, let's go to Mount Olympus. Let's go to Mount, let's walk up Mount Olympus. You know how big that mountain is? <laughs> this is Mount Olympus. Look how big, big as fuck, dude. <laughs> She's big as hell. It is big as hell. Fucking huge. Even if we make it, you know the, come on, bitch, you know the entire pantheon of gods is up there. You know all the gods are up there. Zeus is up there. Everybody's up there, dude. You're just going to stroll in, walk up Mount Olympus. But I love her, right? So we get to Mount Olympus. 
We're walking up. We get to the top of the mountain. Zeus is there. I told this bitch. I told this bitch Zeus would be there. I just killed Helios, bro. He's pissed. <laughs> Zeus is pissed off, dude. That's him, dude. He's fucking mad as hell. He's like, you killed Helios. I said, yeah, bitch. And? I'll fight Zeus. I don't give a fuck. He said, I'm not going to fight you. You know what he does? He starts giving my girl back shots. <laughs> Zeus starts fucking my girlfriend. I'm the top of <laughs> Mount Olympus. Bro, what the fuck? You clicked that? the wrong one. That, that speech club was supposed to say bitch-ass white boy. You oh, the wrong one. Oh, you want me to go back? Is he going to fuck up the rest of it? I mean, it'll take a long time. Nah. I... Imagine that speech bubble says <laughs> <laughs> bitch-ass white boy. That's what he was calling me. Said bitch ass boy hit my girlfriend back shot. What's under the thing that says boob? <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry about that. That's my girlfriend, dude. What the fuck? <laughs> Wanna know what's under there? You're next, y'all fucking. <laughs> Zeus the bitch. I can't stand I can't what am I gonna do? Sit around and watch this shit? Hell no, dude. I gotta fuck Zeus up now. It's fucking the shit for I do to this bitch. Gotta fight Zeus, so here I'm, I grab, grab him like this by his head. <laughs> I'm fucking idiot, didn't even see it coming. Wow, hit him with a knee like that. <laughs> fucking fool, lit his ass up, dude. Fucking idiot, then I'm in there. Wow, 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 in there, wow, me, 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 me. Idiot does a me, me, me. He tried to swing one time, I went, me, 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 me. Idiot. I do that for like three, four, five minutes. Until I fucking can't breathe. Zeus is dead. <laughs> Just killed Zeus. He's the leader of the pantheon. What the fuck am I going to do now? This dude's the head of the gods. Fucking bitch ass Zeus. Killed his ass. You think I'm done with him though? You can give my girl back shots? I'm giving you back shots. Oh no. Bitch ass boy, I'm giving Zeus back shots. Oh no. Fuck Zeus on the top of Mount Olympus. Oh no. Look at him. Ah, that's no. me. That's me as fuck, dude. I'm in there. Oh, no. I'm in there like swimwear, dude. Oh no. What an idiot. Look at him look dumb like that. Yeah, dude, and I did all that for her. We got all got off the mountain and shit. She's fucking. I'm like, I'm hungry as fuck. I just beat Zeus to death and raped him. I'm pretty hungry. <laughs> so we get something to eat. What do you want, raisin cane? She goes, I don't know. I don't know. This this bitch tripping. <laughs> this bitch is tripping, dude. I do so much. She cool though. Uh, all right, that's my present. <laughs> that's me, guys. <laughs> Uh, for real, for real. Give it up for Nick, everybody. Oh, fuck, man. Who thought that was real? Make some noise if you thought that was pretty real. <laughs> uh, we actually, uh, we just got this in. Is the, how long has the sign been off? <laughs> how long has the sign not... No, 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 no. All right, you do that. Cool. No, just just lean it up. It's not gonna do. Just lean it up against it. It's a whole thing. Oh, perfect. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Perfect. <laughs> All right. All Let's right. Who's, who's going out after this? Is anybody going out on the town after this? Wait. We got a video in. Oh, we got a, video. a last minute oh, video, okay. everybody. Oh, oh shit. Just a little, okay. Yeah. We need the the sound back there. I don't know if this is an ad or not. Typically, it's an ad, but. Generally, this is where we show how we make some money around here. We yeah, keep, keep the lights off. Keep the lights on. Yeah. <laughs> Costs a lot keep of money to off. keep the lights on. It costs more than to keep them on. Let's see. Oh my god, but he's banned. <laughs> <laughs> he might be here tonight. Yeah. What the fuck? <laughs> Motherfuckers. 
You want to fuck with me? Ugh. You did this. This isn't just me doing this. This isn't me pulling the trigger. This is the whole city. This is the whole fucking state of Texas. You're Motherfuckers! by Pornhub this week. <laughs> oh, what the fuck? That's a sponsor we've been waiting on, finally. <laughs> finally. I guess they settled, finally. Holy shit. <laughs> oh, dude. What, a break. what a special guest. Yeah, I mean, uh, our next president, we're very excited. Is anybody going out after this? Anybody going to go out and drink or party? This next uh, correspondent's gonna give you a little guide on how to do that. This is Lil Bat King. She yeah. talks about nightlife. Lil Bat King. Lil Bat King. Yeah. Hello, motherfucker. All right, there she is. I'm gonna tell you guys what to do in that time. You guys, daytime people, get loud as fuck for night. <laughs> All right, sick. Yeah, there it is. All yeah. right, first up. Oh wait, what? No, you're good. Okay, you're sure. Alright, first up, you could go to Zilker Park at night time and, you know, risk getting stabbed. And you could buy meth or whatever. Or you could hang out with me, because I'll be robbing storage units! <laughs> During the daytime. What? <laughs> I don't know, I'm blind. <laughs> I I mostly rob them for rare Yu-Gi-Oh cards. <laughs> All right, sick. <laughs> you could go to Barbarella's, you know, if you want to see all your friends try and fail to get laid. <laughs> sure, it's fun. You know, it's so much fun watching your friends scream at the top of your lungs, what do you do for work? <laughs> Personally, I like to do one of my favorite things, which is piss in a drawer. <laughs> This one, uh, this one kind of just speaks for itself. Just a fun time. Cool. <laughs> All right, you could go to Diddy Dog if you want to get food poisoning for the fifth time. <laughs> or if you want to buy me food because I ran through my allowance this week. Jack? No. <laughs> I also have a bomb. <laughs> no, no, no. Buy me Diddy Dog. <laughs> All right, or you can hang out with me. I'll be playing Yu-Gi-Oh! <laughs> I found a lot of cool cards in safe space storage. <laughs> this is the best one. I like to do this fun thing where if you lose, I get to stab you a bunch with a mechanical pencil. <laughs> All right, sick. You guys want to play after this? No. What the hell? Okay, oh. sick. I got just the mechanical pencil for you. <laughs> it's dildo shape. <laughs> All right, you could go, you know, you could go to 24 hour fitness if you want to keep kidding yourself. <laughs> Fat. <laughs> or you can hang out with me and watch me play with my butterfly knives. <laughs> so cool. <laughs> My mom confiscated half of them, but uh, you could just watch me play. <laughs> I learned a new one where I only slightly hurt my hands every time. <laughs> All right, cool. Next up, you could, you know, file a re police report. What, 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 what the fuck this is This is a it? great example of a good police report. <laughs> Details you don't even want to know. <laughs> All right. Or you can hang out with me, because I'll be chucking bacon at police cars. <laughs> you know, raw bacon, cook bacon. It's not a felony if you can run fast. <laughs> All right, and that's nighttime. <laughs> low back kick, everybody. <laughs> Make it laugh for low back kick. All right, guys, we got two left. Are you, are you having a good time so far? That's not right. 
Guys, we have two special guests to close this out. This first one is a real big treat. We have never had him on the show, and I think you'll all know him very well. Give it up right now for the hilarious White Bernie Mac, everybody. It's White Bernie Mac. I am scared of you motherfuckers. <laughs> you know, a lot of people, they, they like sex. I'm not a big sex guy because uh, I'm not very blessed, you know? <laughs> not very big boned, not very heavy structured. In fact, if I pull my shit out right now, this whole room would get disappointed, you know? <laughs> Kick it! You guys don't even understand, all right? I am so scared right now. I'm so scared right now. I'm so terrified right now. A lot of guys like sex. I'm not a big sex guy, you know. Wouldn't it be zany, though, if they started selling sex in a can? That'd be... I know a lot of guys who would probably steal it from the store, but a guy like me, I'm going to buy that stuff on sale. You know what I'm saying? That's right. Playing checkers with my friends. I gotta leave, fellas. There's a there's a sale on sex at the store. All right, kick it. All right, cut it, cut it, cut it, cut it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm so scared of you, motherfuckers. You guys have no idea. I'm so scared right now. I was at a bar the other night. This girl was like, uh, "Hey, Mac." I was like, "That's my name. What's up? What's going on?" <laughs> She was like, Mac, do you know the difference? Uh, <laughs> she said, Mac, does pussy taste like pumpkin pie? I was like, I don't know, I've never had pussy before. All right, get good. All right, I'm White Birdie Mac, everybody. <laughs> White Birdie Mac. <laughs> White Birdie Mac. <laughs> oh, what a treat. He's uh, on his way. <laughs> oh. Next oh, up, uh, how are we feeling, everybody? Yeah. <laughs> Our next correspondent, we got two more correspondents. Two more. Our next correspondent is going to tell you a little bit how the night's been going. It, it, I mean, he'll probably tell you what you already know. Good time, right? Yeah? Yeah? yeah. Give it up for Grant Wheel, everybody, with the vibe check. A little vibe check. Come on, what's up, dude? So I said, stretch, make some noise. It's the motherfucking vibe check. <laughs> What's up, Jay? What's up, Mike? What's, What's up, up Grant? Hell yeah. Uh, what up, Nick? What up, dog? <laughs> <laughs> We're in it. Oh, uh, I'm in a good ass mood. I went to work, came home from work, pounded a yerba, popped a zin, smoked a bowl, headed to good evening news. What's up, boobs? Uh, <laughs> how's it going? <laughs> Almost everyone is still here. That's, that's a record. <laughs> Three, six. Uh, all right, off the top. National Anthem, heavy as fuck. Give it up for that. That was cool as shit. Mm -hmm. Oh my God, we gotta do it every time. <laughs> I wanna fucking, I don't know, I'll breathe fog forever. Uh, <laughs> I nominate Maddie Stewart as National Anthem Captain. Uh, <laughs> headlines work, kick, fucking ass, guys. Oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> that never oh, happens. <laughs> <laughs> ever. Uh, probably the best I've ever seen. I love the Dollar Tree joke. That was a good job. Good job, brethren. Uh, what a crowd tonight. <laughs> and then, hell yeah, Necromancer Nick saved the day because uh, he's the best. <laughs> all right. Oh, uh, really sweet. Hell yeah, Facts. dog. All right. It's all facts. Uh, oh God, okay. We don't play games, Jack. Uh, <laughs> we don't game during the vibe check, dude. It's all straight vibes. Uh, anxiety. Shut up, fat ass. <laughs> Yo, bitch ass up, lady. The whole goddamn show. I've seen you the entire time just walk your fucking chicken leg ass out of here. Walk out. You feel like a bucket of chicken, ho. Shut up. Shut up. Fucking Gordita Crunch. My number is 832-257-5935. Call me later and shut the fuck up right now. 
It's been hell. <laughs> and I, I feel for the guys up here, damn it. Uh, next fucking segment. Uh, give it up for Scott motherfucking Belmore, everybody. Holy shit. Holy shit. Fuck around and find God, brethren. <laughs> you fat asshole. Uh, not Scott. Scott's cool. Uh, all I fear is him. Uh, all, I, all I fear is him. Uh, Christ is red as fuck. Heaven, yeah. <laughs> Sir Christ, uh, Sir Cut, that was my favorite thing. Uh, hell yeah. Joe Biden was in the house, that was insane. Uh, no one gave a fuck about that, which was really rude. Really rude. Especially you. <laughs> Especially you, yeah, but it's okay. I'll make you a character. Uh, I don't know. I think everyone wants to vote Biden and vote Trump. I think it's stupid. I think everyone should vote for something that we all have, like these nuts. Uh, <laughs> yeah, dude, these nuts 2024. <laughs> 2024 can blow me. Uh, <laughs> Did you hear something? <laughs> Do you want to make out and shut the fuck up right now? <laughs> dude, I'll make out with you right fucking now, dude. Hush. <laughs> hell yeah, pretty much uh, what I'm trying to say about the presidents, uh, the aliens are coming. Watch out. Uh, we got one in the front row. Uh, cool. Shout out. Shout out Joe Smith. <laughs> Free Diddy Dog. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> don't eat Diddy Dog. You'll shit for years. Uh, hell yeah. <laughs> Give it up for Dan Sedica, uh, the love doctor. I don't know, someone really needs to Sedica his dicka. <laughs> or at least give him kisses. Everyone needs kisses. Uh, yeah. Uh, cool. For real, for real. For real, for real. Too many skanks in these hoes. Uh, I'll fuck that line up. Uh, let me read. <laughs> Too many sneaky hoes in these streets. Uh, enough said. All right. I love the Pornhub commercial. Uh, it was great. Lots of passion. Uh, <laughs> And Lil Bat King was badass. Uh, she can have all my Yu-Gi-Oh cards. <laughs> Every one of them. Uh, White Bernie Mac. <laughs> Wicked. Uh, it's so zany. <laughs> so, so silly. <laughs> he was very scared. I loved it. Uh, fuck yeah. So far, if I've checked, going okay. Uh, <laughs> going okay. If you're having a good time, I need everybody to listen up. If you're having a good time, I need you to just fucking scream as loud as you can. Go fucking nuts. But if you're having a bad time... I need you to be like, fuck you. <laughs> all right, are you having a good time? Yeah. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Are you having a bad time? Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> fuck yeah, vibe check complete. Uh, vibe check complete. I think it was like a four star. Uh, probably three and a half because you're fat. <laughs> you, you fucking beat the scale. Uh, no, I'm just kidding. I'm fat too. Uh. Everybody have a good night. I'm gonna go fuck her later. Uh, thank you. Well, I probably won't. Uh, everybody have a good night. Real, real, real. What the fuck? Hell yeah. All time. What a legend. Oh my god. All right, guys. We're capping it off. Who's ready to close this out? Oh my god. Your last one of the night. It's always a pleasure. He has a show coming up in a couple of weeks, and he's here to promote it. It's the one and only Donnie Haynes, everyone. Oh, shit. Wait, no, keep them off. Hold on. Yep. There we go.
Herbert the Frog is dead. Show some fucking respect. <laughs> you dumb bitch! <laughs> No, they thought, uh, they thought what was just a common cold, um, it was actually a cancer that metastasized into his, little, into his throat. Oh my God, yeah. Doctors didn't want to operate on it because they thought it was just a, they thought he just had a frog in his throat. Oh my God, it's too soon, Donnie. <laughs> Jesus. He's dead though. <laughs> Hear the king! <laughs> As you all know, we had, Oh, God damn it! Not the fog machine again. <laughs> That's enough fog. <laughs> God damn. As you all know, uh, Kermit and I had a similar love interest. Miss Biggie. It's true. She sucked the cotton off my cock. <laughs> it wasn't just normal head, it was, well, as I described it, it was boar's head. <laughs> <laughs> the fucking fog! <laughs> Damn you with the fog! fucking see in here. <laughs> Gallons of fog. Liquid <laughs> fog. <laughs> Shut up, bitch! <laughs> Shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> Ma'am, do me a favor, check underneath your seat. It's a bomb. <laughs> <laughs> identify as a home run, because you're out of here. <laughs> Don't beach! <laughs> as you all know, we have a Donnie and Haynes and friends and everybody's gonna be <laughs> gonna be here in a couple months. It's true. A couple months? A couple months. <laughs> We just got official word, Chad Smith from the Red Hot Chili Peppers. He, he confirmed. Come on. That's big news. That's okay. Hey, that's right. Come on. Yeah. Holy fuck, yeah. You guys, Jack mentioned it. <laughs> what a riff. <laughs> Man, I'm gonna, ask, I'm gonna have to ask you to put a sock in it. <laughs> <laughs> the beach! <laughs> see anything. Fuck. Everybody's acting crazy. But um, to do a little, we're trying to do a little promotion for the Donnie Haynes and Friends group. So far we only have 300 tickets sold. <laughs> and we want, we want the fire department to get called. <laughs> we want 5,000 people to be here. <laughs> So we're going to be releasing a new single every week. Is that okay with you guys? You guys like to hear a new single? Do you guys like a little music? All right. All right. Uh, Necromancer Nick, if you could, thank you so much. Necromancer Nick, everybody on the guitar. Thank you. song called Love is But a Number, Why Not Three? So much fog and everything. Everybody get loud as fuck. Put your phones on flashlight mode. Don't use your lighters though. It might combust and blow the whole building up. How does it feel, this love with us both? I love it. I love our connection, kinetic energy. 
momentum. Built on thrust. What is love if not built on trust? What shall we do? What shall we not? Another weatherman, you are a bitch. <laughs> I got my hat back and my brain is attached. I've got my head on my shoulders. I'm ready to hatch like an egg from a chicken. And I'm smitten and I'm in love and I'm sweet. <laughs> Add another, a man or a bitch. Add another, grant me this witch. <laughs> I want to kiss, feel, know what's real. I want to feel, kiss and talk, touch and know what it is must and I want sweeter embracement for my butter butter of fruits garner of sin I am your man you are my kin and my brother <laughs> I'm but a bastard a spawn from hell Oh, well. <laughs> Thank you, Master Nick, everybody. Thank you, Master Nick. And Donnie Haynes, everybody. So much fucking fun. Thank you. Thank you. Good night.